the police officer tonight in court, tears as he answered questions after shooting and killing an unarmed black athlete. The football player whose car had crashed was looking for help. A neighbor frightened by him called 911. An officer arrives and that gun fired. The unarmed 24-year-old did not survive. That officer now charged in his murder, taking the stand again today. And here's ABC's Steve Osinsami. As he charged towards me, he got within arm's reach and I discharged my firearm. Tonight, the emotional explanation from a white former police officer fighting for his freedom after killing this former college football player nearly two years ago. What were you on to the suspect? Get on the ground! Get on the ground! Get on the ground! Randall Carrick is testifying this week that he thought the unarmed young black man was going to attack him and two other officers. What did you interpret his body language to mean? He was going to attack me. He was going to assault me. He was going to take my gun from me. In dash cam video, you do see 24-year-old Jonathan Farrell running towards the camera. Get on the ground! But prosecutors say he was just disoriented and had been knocking on doors for help after wrecking his car in the middle of the night, scaring one homeowner who called 911. They say Carrick was the only officer of the three who fired his gun, hitting the young man 10 times. He now faces up to 11 years in prison if he's convicted of voluntary manslaughter. The trial resumes Monday. David. Steve Osinsami with us tonight.